Hi there everyone, I'm Newsday Meteorologist Ashley Baylor with a check of your latest forecast. Hopefully you're having a great Friday so far. The weather is absolutely fantastic. We are enjoying lots of sunshine. Temperatures are going to be nice and warm, topping out in the mid to upper 70s. And we will stay mostly dry. And the reason I say mostly is because we will have a cold front come through this evening. As that frontal boundary comes through, it may spark a spot shower for inland areas. I'll show you that on our hour by hour forecast here. So there you can see again a spot shower coming through Litchfield and Hartford County but I do think most of us will stay perfectly dry. The chance of a stray shower will continue overnight into very early tomorrow morning. If we see a shower or two tomorrow morning, it's going to be a little more likely closer to the shoreline. So that is certainly great news for all the runners and spectators of the Eversource Hartford Marathon and Half Marathon. So we'll initially start with some clouds Saturday morning, but as you can see by midday, we'll be seeing nice bright conditions. And it'll stay bright through the afternoon. The only problem is behind that cold front, well, the colder air gets ushered in here. So notice that 8 o'clock tomorrow morning temperatures are going to be starting near 40 degrees. So quite chilly for the start of the marathon. By 10 o'clock temperatures will move into the upper 40s. There will be a little bit of a northwest breeze. Hopefully that will work for the runners and not against them. And by noon temperatures will inch into the lower 50s. So tonight scattered clouds. There could be a spot shower by morning as temperatures drop into the upper 30s to mid 40s. Tomorrow clouds early giving way to increasing sunshine and highs back in the upper 50s. But we'll see the numbers nudge into the lower 60s for Sunday. Monday looking like a very nice day with highs in the low 60s. Very pleasant right through Tuesday into Wednesday. Plenty of sunshine there with highs in the mid 60s. And then the next thread of showers will likely be late next Thursday into Friday.